and welcome to Express Yourself. My name is Tokwa Olonio. Today on the show, we're going to be talking about the child not bride situation here in Nigeria, which came up after a renowned senator took a 13-year-old girl as his bride. Now, sources have it that some religions permit a man to marry as many as four wives, and others permit men to marry girls as early as when they have started to see their monthly period which can be between 11 to 12 years of age. Now, people of the public are complaining, not because they're against any religion, but because they want these men to put the health of these young girls into consideration. More of this after the break. Hello and welcome to Sights and Sounds of London. Today, we're going to be visiting two regularly visited places by tourists here in London. Right now, I'm at the River Thames. You know, this river's got its name from the Sanskrit name Tamar. It's actually the longest river in England and the second longest in the United Kingdom. It's actually 215 miles long. Another thing is this river actually has 25 different species of coarse fishes. Now this is a must visit for any first timer in London. We can see the London Eye, the Tower Bridge is also across it. A lot of bridges goes right across this and you have to come visit this place if you're a first timer in London. I'm out. Hello and welcome to the travel guide. Now, are you ready for some armchair travel? Well, it could be a whole lot more than that because you could be the winner of today's holiday competition. All you have to do is answer this simple question. Which fortified wine gets its name from the Portuguese town of Oporto? Is it A, Sherry, B, Madeira or C, Port? If you think you know the answer, then give us a call on 0800 222 Calls cost no more than 25p and we would announce the winner at the end of the program. Hello, I'm Tapa Alonio and welcome to Bay Lunch News. Today we have three different stories which are local boys stabbed in Wembley Park, the increase in A-level results in Brent and a ridiculous day when the sky went black and many people thought it was a scene from the film titled Apocalypse. First, the tragic story of a youth getting stabbed whilst on the 182 street. We're going to Victor Nathan for the latest development on this case. Hello, welcome back to the Sight and Sound of London. Right now, I'm at the Trafalgar Square, which is called the centre of London. It's located at the city of Westminster. Now, as a tourist and you haven't been to Trafalgar Square, then you haven't been to London. If you look right up there, we have the statue of Nelson Horatio. Now, Nelson Horatio led the British army to the Battle of Trafalgar, and the, which, of course, they won. And he has the four lions, the four lion statues, which actually protect the statue of Nelson Horatio. I am here touring London at the Trafalgar Square. As the first time I'm in London, if you're not at the Trafalgar Square, then you are not in London. Ciao. 